Hello everyone, I'm Elias Borges, and today we're going to talk about whether or not you can patent a fork. In this case, this particular plastic fork. So let's talk about that. Yes, you can. You can patent a plastic fork if the design of the fork is new and has some new features, or perhaps how that fork is made, maybe that's new. If it, can, if it is new, then you could potentially patent that. Or the material it's made out of, that could be patented as well. And the actual three-dimensional design, the aesthetic appeal of it, that can be protected with a design patent. Now here's an example of a utility patent which was granted on a new fork design. Now, this is a very interesting device. It is a combination of fork and chopsticks. So it's a fork at one end and the handle of the fork doubles as chopsticks. So that's an example of the utility of the design being patented. And here's an example of a patent which was granted for a plastic fork which has a type of metal coating applied to it. So it's the actual material it's made out of which is patented. And not only that, but they needed to develop a special kind of method to coat that metal onto that fork. So the method of actually making this fork is also protected by this patent. And here's an example of a design patent which protects the look of this new fork. Now, the handle of this fork is very decorative. So the design patent is specific to protect the look of the handle. It doesn't really protect the tines. So can we get a patent for our specific plastic fork? Well, there are a lot of different plastic forks available on the marketplace. So the only aspects of our fork which could be protected are the ones which are different from the other forks that are on the market. So how is our fork different? Well, if you look at it carefully, these tines in the center are relatively close together compared to the tines on the outside. The tines on the outside are a little bit further apart. So this has an unusual orientation of the tines. So perhaps that gives it some kind of functional advantage, which might be protectable via a patent. If we turn the fork over, we can see that there's a couple of other features about it. First of all, there are these ridges that kind of go around the outside of the fork, the periphery of the fork. And they kind of also go along these two center tines. Now these ridges are there for structural support because plastic is a very flexible type of material doesn't have a lot of strength we put in these reinforcing ridges to make this fork stronger however when we look at other plastic forks and we flip them over we discover that these reinforcing ridges have been used for a long time. So here's an example of another plastic fork, which is commonly available. And you can see the same types of ridges used to do the same thing. So what this means is that feature, the ridges, we can't get a patent for that because it's already old. But the features of the tines, the spacing of the tines, if there's some benefit for that, well, we may be able to get a patent for that. So the bottom line here is that, yes, it's possible that we might be able to get a patent for the arrangement of the tines on that plastic fork because it appears to be new. So if you like this video, please press the like button. And if you have any comments, please go ahead, ask any questions. I'm always happy to answer them. And do me a favor, subscribe to the channel because there are more videos coming. I'm Elias Borges, registered patent and trademark agent and lawyer. I'll see you next time.